Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Dia Wall with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines. Johnson County has three new presumptive positive cases of COVID-19. That brings the total number of cases in the county and in Kansas to four. The three new patients are men between the ages of 35 and 65. They all attended the same conference in Florida and started feeling symptoms after they returned home in early March. Kansas City Mayor Quentin Lucas issued a state of emergency for the city in response to coronavirus concerns. For 21 days, all events with more than 1,000 people in attendance must be canceled or delayed until the state of emergency is lifted. The Big 12 tournament in Kansas City has been canceled as concerns mount over the spread of COVID-19 across the country. The SEC and Big 10 basketball tournaments were also canceled today. Gerard Bailey has our forecast now. Thank you, Dia. We have colder air moving into the area and uh, we'll be seeing our temperatures fall as we head through tonight. We reached the 60s today. That was nice to have, but here comes the colder temperatures as we move into Friday. We're going to have more uh, clouds as we head into the afternoon and evening on Friday. A disturbance is coming in and we're going to be looking at rain and snow likely moving into the weekend starting late Friday night through uh, Saturday morning. The best chance of rain will be down to the south of I-70. Best chance of uh, snow will be north of us, closer to the Iowa border. Right in between them, near Kansas City, we could be looking at a mixture of rain and snow. Right now, accumulations look very, very light, with the best chance of any accumulations far to the north. We're talking uh, a dusting to perhaps an inch or two way up there, but the majority of us will not see uh, much in the ways of snowfall, but it is going to be quite wet as we move through Saturday. Remember to get all your latest news and weather updates anytime on KSHB.com.